guys, it's Ashlyn. So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a, just like another haul video. You guys seem to really like my haul videos, so I decided I'm gonna do another one. This one isn't like huge, still gonna do it because why not? But before we get started, I did wanna mention, I got this necklace, it was sent to me. This video isn't sponsored, but they did send it to me to include it in a video, but the brand is by Sofield. I have mentioned it in another video before, but now I actually have it on and I have been wearing it a lot recently. I really like it. My family is so loud. I'm gonna talk a little bit about the necklace before we get started It's not gonna be for a long time. So first of all the necklace that I'm wearing is their personalized birthstone name necklace in silver So basically you just go on their website It's really easy and then you just type in your name and then if you want the birthstone in it Which is just like over right above the a then you pick your birth month and so since mine is November I got Whatever the November birthstone is, I honestly can't remember. Topaz, maybe? But I really like the look of the birthstone in it, and it just adds a little something more. But it is actually such nice quality, and I'm not just saying that because they sent it to me. Like, I would be completely honest with you guys. Not gonna make you, like, spend your money on something that's not good, but it actually feels like a really, really nice necklace, and... I love this so much. So yeah, these necklaces are so good. I've heard Hayley Morales talk about these before multiple times. Highly recommend them. And again, I'm not just saying that. Like, they did give me a coupon code. And this is not like an affiliate code. Like, I'm not receiving commission on it. I'm not getting paid for saying any of this. It'll be on the screen and in the description. It is for 15% off and it's Ash MG15. I will also link the, in the description the link to this necklace or their website and again they're not paying me for me to say any of this it's not sponsored but one reason why i really like the necklaces is because it's not like super expensive it's like still really nice quality but it's not like a hundred bazillion dollars for a necklace i've been wearing it a lot and it hasn't gotten like rusty or damaged it's again a really nice necklace so anyway now let's go ahead and actually get on to the unboxing because because that's what you came for so anyway i'm first gonna start off with the two packages that i got because i honestly can't remember what i got but it's from an app called octoly so everything i'm mentioning in this video was sent to me so yeah this is the clarins glow to go blush and highlighter duo and i'm actually so excited to use this because i've been wanting to try something different because i don't really have like a cream blush oh well, actually i have one cream blush and like i think a couple slash a few cream highlighters but nothing like this so um again it's by the brand clarins and it just looks like that so this is the highlighter and this is the blush side it's pretty self-explanatory i'm just really excited to try this out because I've been wanting to like try more cream things lately. This is in the shade glowy pink. I don't know if I already said that, but that's what the highlighter looks like. I hope that it doesn't show up too gray on my skin because it's not like the highlighter that I like. So it has like a pink shift to it and also like still icy gray a, a bit. Hopefully it doesn't like show up too gray, but and then the other side again is the blush. Ooh, I think I'm actually gonna really like the shade if I use a minimal amount like if I just take a brush kind of go on and then go on my face I think I'm gonna really like this so excited to try this out. So thank you so much to Clarins They also have I think one other shade and it's for more deeper skin tones And I think it's a I don't I can't remember let me try to see what the other like shade is Okay, so their other one I think is more towards darker skin tones and That is what their other one looks like Anyway, now onto the last package. All right, so the next one is another item from Clarins, and this is the Clarins Instant Poreless Primer. It's a pore blurring mattifying primer, which I believe I'm going to love because I always am looking for a good pore filling primer and one that mattifies my skin. So, like throughout the day, my makeup just doesn't slip off. I don't know, I'll have to try it out. Okay, then the next item. Then the next item I actually got specifically for my mom because I got the full size from Octoly a while ago and I gave it to my mom because I didn't use it as much as I wanted to. My mom is like almost out of it and she loves this stuff. Like she's obsessed with it and she uses it all the time and it's almost gone. So I decided to get the mini size because that's what they had on Octoly. But basically it is by the brand Sol de Janeiro. I feel like I said that way wrong. They call it the Brazilian bum bum cream. It sounds really weird, but like it's just a lotion. 
basically what it's supposed to do is like tighten it's really good and it smells so good it has like i'll read you what the smell is because i'm really bad at describing smells okay so it says that the like fragrances um are pistachio and almond that's like their top ones jasmine petals and heliotrope the dry scent is vanilla salted caramel and sandalwood so this stuff smells amazing like it smells so good but i'm gonna give this to my mom because she uses this all the time highly recommend this even though i don't use it every day the last little package i got a pretty decent size lancome package so i'm gonna show you what was in it so i think there might have been three of these but i can't find the other one i got these two matte shakers is that what it's called yeah so this one is in the shade minimal ochre and then this one is in the shade round purple basically and then you unscrew it and it comes on this little brush and then you just apply it from there. But these are for your lips and they're a really cool concept. They're not the easiest to apply, but it's a cool concept and they're just like fun to use. I don't know. I got two lipsticks and these I were really confused by. So to open it, you click the top just like that. And then this bottom part comes off and then you just pull it from there. And you have your lipstick. So this one is like a bright red shade and it is in the shade 103. And then this next one, this one's in the shade 110. But this one is another like red shade, just more like bright and corally-ish. And then there's more lip products. So these kind of, okay, these I wasn't super impressed by because they like kind of look like you got them from Claire's. They just kind of look odd, especially with how much you're paying for them. So these, I don't know, I wouldn't recommend as much, but basically I got this one in the shade 03 and this one in the shade 01. It's just like a lip pencil and then a lip gloss. So I've used the lip gloss before. I don't think I've, no, I haven't used the lip pencil-ish lipstick parts. The lip gloss has like a really bad smell and taste. I can't stand it, so I had to take it off so I couldn't even wear it. Like, both of them smell like, kind of like burnt plastic. So I cannot wear these. Um, I don't think the top part has it. Yeah, the top part just smells like perfumey makeup. I don't like these, to be honest, but I'll go ahead and swatch. Okay, so these are like really nice. Like they're they have they have a really nice texture and they're really pigmented. It's just like the glosses I wanted to really like, but I just couldn't like them. The lip section I could get by with because I like how that looks. So those are kind of like eh for me. I don't think I would recommend them. And I got this one weird product. I couldn't really tell what it was because it's hard to like see. Like I don't know what these are. Like Lancome, it's kind of hard to tell what things are a little bit. But yeah, that's what it looks like. It's kind of just like this big long pencil looking thing. Honestly, I don't know what this is. I feel like you could either use it on your eyes or your lips. I don't know because it's like this weird teal color, but I did use it for like eyeliner one time and it worked pretty well, but like you couldn't really do that for that long because it's like a, I don't, so I don't. I don't really know what this is. Wait, maybe I could Google Translate it. Let's Google Translate it. Okay, so I think it's a an eye thing from what I got. I don't know. Could I think Kajal? Kajal? Um, I think that means shadow. So we're just gonna go with that. I don't know if that's right, but we'll just go for that. Then I got this eyeshadow. I think I got this whole collection. So I think that's what all of that is because they kind of just like go together like their packaging is like pink and orange and fun, I guess. But this is what their palette looks like. Um, it's called the Chroma Eyeshadow or Eye Palette. All of their stuff has this on it. I don't know what that means. Here, let me Google Translate that. Okay, so if anyone could tell me what this means, that would be great because I literally have no idea what it means and I can't even put it in Google Translate, so. But the eyeshadow palette looks like this and honestly, I was not really feeling it at first because I wasn't really, I don't know, the colors didn't like really speak to me because they're kind of just bland sort of, but I did use it and I did really like it. Like the eyeshadows are really good. They're not awful by any means. And then I tried using this dark brown and this is a cream. So like, I don't really know what the creams are about because the same thing goes for this blue shade. It's also a cream. So I don't, really understand it honestly this whole collection i just don't really understand so just because like it doesn't really make sense to me all this stuff is just like weird and then the last thing is a mascara and this is their monster big mascara i think that's how you pronounce it i don't 
know what it is. And I thought I was just getting like a black mascara because you know that makes sense, but it's purple. Okay, it looks way more purple in person. Okay, it's not really showing up that purple on camera, but I promise it looks more purple in person. But I have worn it to school like actually a few times and you don't really notice. So honestly, this is fine with me. I mean, it's a pretty good mascara. It's not like my favorite mascara ever, but it's not bad. Hey guys, so it is like a few days later and I have two more packages. So I decided I'm just gonna like put it in the video. And this is the day that um, I'm posting this, but I just got two packages. Also, my hair looks really bad because I just had to go out in the rain to get them. And also I'm wearing the same thing because I had to recreate the thumbnail because I forgot to take a thumbnail the first time. So I recreated it today. So I had to put on the same exact thing. I'm also not in my room. I'm in the living room downstairs, right outside my room. So just thought I'd get those things cleared up. So I have two packages and honestly, I don't know what's in here. So we're gonna go ahead with the lighter one first. I'm not gonna make this super long because I don't know. Ooh, if this is what I think it is, I'm so excited. Yes. Okay, so this is by Becca. And since this year is like the year of the pig, which I also saw this on Jeffrey's channel. Um, so if you watch his video, you probably like know the one where he got Shane like $15,000 worth of Gucci. That's where I found that out. But um, he actually had this in his video, but I ordered it before I saw it. This is the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfect. Perfector um, Year of the Pig highlighter. So it's basically just a highlighter, but it has like a pig in it, like pressed into it. This looked really pretty and I'm so excited to try this out. The packaging is so pretty. I'm literally so excited to try this out. I think I'm gonna love this and also it has a cute pig on it, so that's cool. I can already tell that I'm gonna love this and use it all the time. Like that is so pretty. And then the next package is like a bigger one. It seems like it, there's like a lot in it, but I can't remember what it is. These two things are also from Octoly, by the way. Oh my gosh. It's like stuffed bubble wrap. Oh, I remember this. I'm so excited about this because I can start using it. They bubble wrapped it because they didn't want it to like explode, but basically this is by the same brand as the bum bum cream from earlier in the video it's by sol de janeiro if i'm even saying that right but it's their brazilian play moisturizing shower cream gel so like the scent is like pistachio caramel so it's just like the um lotion and all that stuff and i also have a perfume in the scent and i'm obsessed with this scent and i'm so excited to use this thank you so much to becca and sol de janeiro hopefully i'm saying that right yeah anyway now back to the other day that is all the stuff that I have to show you guys today. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!